me a grocery list. Get these pot roast. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Grace. I sat down this morning and made me a grocery list. I kind of meal prepped for this week. So I think I'm going to try to do like make um, some homemade Subway sandwiches for supper one night. We come up with some ribs and there's like this Italian green bean thing that I've done. I hadn't done it in a very long time, but it's really good. It's like a three meal thing in one. And so I to do, I'm going to see how much a chuck roast is. Cause I know sometimes the thing can be high, but I was going to do like a Mississippi pot roast. And then I've got chicken nuggets in the freezer. So I'm going to pick up some French fries and um, I'm going to pick up a few pizzas and some snacks. But just some simple supper because I'm going to be busy this upcoming week. So most of it's going to be crock pot and just something I can cook quick, hopefully. All right, let's get in this grocery haul. So I got a variety pack of chips for the kids. I got some baby carrots to go with the chuck roast. Of course, we had to have some sandwiches for some our sandwiches obviously some bananas because ugly eats full out of them my seasoning mix to go with my stuff some french fries i got some dinner rolls my husband loves these things and some potato chips to go with our sandwiches um i got some pie crust i was gonna try to make a pie this week but it didn't pan out some brown sugar for another recipe i was wanting to try uh the chuck roast and um chicken breast i'll get it out in a second i also got some ribs that i'm going to do in the crock pot um some sandwich meat um, banana peppers some instant yeast green beans and some olive oil got some red potatoes and some apples and got some cheese to go on the sandwiches and italian dressing and some cheese sticks some french onion dip to go with the chips some shredded lettuce and some fiber bars and then i went down the dollar aisle and they had these little wafers and some cookies that i got for the kids kind of snack on got some prune juice and some pizza for one night and that's pretty much gonna wrap it up y'all but i got all this for about 130 bucks at um piggly wiggly so now moving on to the dishes i'm unloading the dishwasher for the evening and i'm gonna load it back up i try to do this every evening so that way i don't have such a mess in the mornings but sometimes i just don't make it and if y'all hear me sniffling my allergies are really 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 bad right now and i've got a load of wash going right now but I, like I said, I always try to make sure I got my dishwasher loaded back up so that way I ain't got nothing in the sink. But sometimes it don't happen. Okay, so if you are new to my channel, my house is not aesthetically pleasing. It's lived in like the cabinets here. They need painting. I keep having somebody to comment saying I need to paint my cabinets. I understand they need painting, but that's the least of my worries right now. Um, my bedroom curtains are hung up with thumbtacks because honestly, I keep forgetting to pick up curtain rods, but it does not bother me. If small stuff like that bothers you, my channel might not be for you because my home is lived in. It is an older 
mobile home and some of the things that might bother people don't bother me and me and my family are happy with what we have so honestly I don't understand why people just can't you know go on about their business but they've got to leave they've got to say something but you know even though you're being rude you still watch the video and that person still gets paid so they still benefit from it just so you know but um yeah so either way I get paid for your rude comment so it really don't bother me but it takes zero effort to be kind and that is what we're about here because you never know somebody's mental state or their mental health and that little rude comment might not be a big deal to you but it could be to them and that's that's where i draw the line so if you're going to keep making um if you're going to make rude comments on my channel i will block you and you will not be able to comment on my stuff anymore and i will continue to do that so here i'm cutting up some apples for my daughter's snack she loves these and i cut them up kind of like french fries and then um i have some caramel syrup that I put in there so she can dip them and you know she loves this all the kids love this y'all so once again i made some more homemade bread y'all this stuff is so good i've just started making it like every week and i made two loaves this time instead of one big old loaf but um i'm trying to get into where i have more homemade stuff and kind of getting away from the grocery store i'm trying my best slowly getting there it's a step at a time but here i'm packing up uh we had breakfast for supper so I'm just putting what I had left in the refrigerator so my husband has something to eat for breakfast in the morning. So don't don't let stuff go to waste. <laughs> And if y'all are wondering what that big bucket is, it is laundry detergent. Yes, laundry detergent. My husband picked it up for me, so I should have laundry detergent for a while. I'm, I will say I am set on laundry detergent. <laughs> My husband bought me some new headphones I didn't didn't have a pair and sometimes I like listening to music while cleaning y'all it took me a minute to figure these things out I am NOT technology savvy the other day I was trying to get my computer to work and I don't know what has happened to it but it won't pop up the Wi-Fi where I can even connect to it because the editor I have on my phone it's just not working I guess because I have such more higher quality videos now I don't know what I'm gonna do so that's kind of put a delay on me trying to push out videos because I have been trying y'all but it takes me forever even longer to edit than what it normally does so I got to figure something out but also I'm trying to get more active on TikTok also so that way I kind of have two platforms so I've been trying to do all that as well.
days are definitely starting to get longer. Um, it was, this was probably like at 6 o'clock. And usually by then, by 6 or 6.30, you know, the sun is done about down. But the days are definitely starting to get longer. Y'all, my floor had so many crumbs on it. Oakley was eating biscuit and she got it everywhere, y'all. <laughs> Just got my wet and dry uh, vacuum slash mop thing, my jigger, and just going to mop up the floors. I love this thing, and it has a carpet. You can clean your rugs with it too. It has two settings on the handle, so I absolutely love this. When I have to get a hold of the Oakley's rug right there in the middle of the floor, that is super small for the living room, but it's okay. this thing has got some suction behind it okay because I'm struggling trying to keep a rug straight right here <laughs> <laughs> 